Welcome to FootballGamePlan.com, where football makes sense. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook here at MetLife Stadium, where the 2018 MetLife Bowl took place between the New York Jets and the New York Giants. Now, the Giants came away victorious by the score of 22-16. to 16. Some quick takeaways offensively for the New York Jets. You know Sam Darnold got the start tonight, and I thought he made great decisions with the football. He saw the field well. He saw the feel like a veteran. The placement on his passes were a little bit off. Sometimes they were high. Sometimes they were a little bit to the left, to the right. But the fact that he was able to see the field well was key. Defensively for the Jets, I thought they were outstanding. Their front seven looks ferocious. The run fits were where they need to be. They're really slowing down a Giants run game, essentially making them one-dimensional in the first half where the starters were playing most of the snaps. Now, on the flip side for the Giants, offensively speaking, Eli Manning was able to connect deep down the field with Cody Latimer, who I thought played a phenomenal game. The running game wasn't there, like I mentioned earlier. The offensive line had some issues as far as getting guys out the way off the spot. Now, again, they didn't play without, they played without, I'm sorry, Odell Beckham Jr. They played without Sa Saquon Barkley. But what they had to do was try to find ways to generate offense without those key players out there on the field. Two guys that stepped up, like I mentioned, Cody Latimer and also Sterling Shepard did a great job today getting open, finding open space, and making some receptions. I want to say Sterling Shepard had seven targets. He caught all seven passes. Defensively for the Giants, they really had some issues on the outside versus the running game, the outside run. I thought that's where the Jets really had their way with that Giants defense. They couldn't set the edge versus the, versus the run and funnel things back inside and had issues in stopping the run that first drive. The Jets really ran the football down the field, and Bilal Powell ended up punching it into the end zone for six. But overall, I thought this was a very good defensive game because the Giants defense had their success against the Jets running game after that first drive. So, again, good defensive front seven play. Offense was a little bit inconsistent without their stars, but We'll see. This was a tune-up game for both teams, as we'll see in preseason game four. Mostly backups and reserves trying to fight for those jobs on these rosters. So that's a wrap here for MetLife Stadium. I'm Emory Hunt, the czar of the playbook. Be sure to follow me on all of my social media accounts. And for all of our 2018 NFL team previews, they're now up all on our YouTube channel. Follow the link at YouTube.com slash football game plan.